A mink, a fink, a skating rink. What is a noun? By Brian P. Clearly, illustrated by Jenya Prolsnitsky. Noun. A word that names a person, animal, place, or thing. A mink, a fink, a skating rink. What is a noun? A hill is a noun. Mill is a noun. Even Uncle Phil is a noun. Gown is a noun. Crown is a noun. In fact, our whole hometown is a noun. If it's a deck, a duck, or a deer, if it's a crystal chandelier, if it's a train or brain or frown, it's elementary. It's a noun. Nouns can sometimes be quite proper, like Brooklyn Bridge or Edward Hopper, London Levi Peckinese. Proper nouns name all of these. A jail, a nail, a bale of hay, the pool or park in which you play, a quarter, a porter, a pencil or pair. Nouns are seen most everywhere. A box, a lip, a chocolate chip, a cup or glass from which you sip, a pocket, button, sleeve or cuff. A noun can simply be your stuff. A mink, a fink, a skating rink, a cake, a rake, your kitchen sink, the pope, some soap, that's on a rope, a downtown mall, a downhill slope, a house, a mouse, a broken clock, New Mexico, an old white sock, welcome to Santa Fe, some tar, a bar, a baseball star, the place where mother parks her car, reserved for mom. A noun can be your Auntie Lynn, the mayor of the town you are in, your friend who tells you corny jokes. <laughs> a noun can be your favorite folks. A collar, a scholar, a handful of sand, saxes and faxes, doo -doo 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 -doo. the brass in the band, a cat, a bat, your grandma's hat, Nouns are a little of this and that. If it's a place of any kind, a mountain, hall, or highway, number nine. If it's a country, state, or town, then surely, surely, it's a noun. USA, Mexico, Ohio, St. Petersburg, and so is a poodle, cherry strudel, a fork, a cork, a curly noodle, a king, a queen, some gasoline, a red raspberry ice machine. If it's a person, place, or thing, your dad, Detroit, a diamond ring, lions, tigers, bears, if it's a boat or coat or clown, it's simple, Simon, it's a noun. So, what is a noun? Do you know? Thanks for joining us, guys. And remember that AM and PM story time is for any time of the day, whether you're just waking up, noontime snacking, or bedtime is happening. Stop by and enjoy a book with us.